Yo, on the he smash. Hey, say where he smash on the link up. On the link up, she smash on the link up. Oh, Young Don got the sauce. Yes, sir. We like those. Give give my man's Young Don a yes, sir in the chat. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man smashed on the link up. Yes, sir. Hey, hey, before you watch this video, I want to give a quick shout out to the sponsor, the newest sponsor of the channel. They're called Lamp Tea, okay? They got these cool lamps. They got Fortnite lamps, elephants, animals, just all types of lamps that I feel like I should check out. There's multiple, like, light colors that y'all can do. You know what I'm saying? White, yellow, teal. Who's doing teal? You know what I'm saying? Purple. You know what I'm saying? Listen, 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 listen. It changes color. You know what I'm saying? If you got the whole LED setup, you feel me? Why would you not? You know what I'm saying? If you have the whole LED setup, why would you not add a little spice, add a little flavor to to your room? You know what I'm saying? You got the LEDs that's wrapped around a room. Go get yourself a lamp. The link is in the description under Lamp Tea. You can use Lamp Tea dash Simba the God for a discount code or click the link in the description. I feel like it's easy to click the link. But definitely, definitely check them out. Let them know I sent you by using that affiliate link or that code. And uh, let me know if you buy anything. You know what I'm saying? Comment down below. Let me know if you got something for some family, birthdays, things like that. But with that being said, it's been your girl Simba. I hope you enjoy this upcoming video. And you have yourself a go, man. Peace. It's Simba here, and we back with another reaction. Do you feel me? I got the Twitch babies over here, you know what I'm saying? Chatting it up in the chat, saying hi to y'all or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But today, we is watching Young Don. This is I wrecked her bathroom on our first date. I beg your pardon? Are you good? You had, he had a leaky, it sounded like he had a leaky booty, you know what I'm saying, on their first date. But we first to check this out. Before we do that, I need y'all to like the video. Oh! Uh, burp, my bad. Like the video. Let's, let's hit these like goals. Subscribe to the channel if you have. Turn on them post notifications. Do you feel me? Comment down below what you thought about the video after we watch everything. And if you ever want to be a part of the Twitch babies, this is where you need to be. 7.30 Eastern Standard Time. But let's get into it, man. He had some Chipotle. Probably. He probably done blew her bathroom up. You know what I'm saying? Had the outside neighbors smelling the dookie. You know what I mean? Crazy, crazy. But let's check this video out, man. Let's get it. When suddenly... I'm awoken by a strange feeling in my stomach. Uh-huh. Oh, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. My stomach had the grumbles. It wasn't a good sign. Oh, bro, listen. Chat, y'all ever had them grumbles at school? Chat, listen, listen. Now, you know what's a worse pain than having to burp and it go back down? Having to fart and it go, you don't fart because you're in, like, a public area. And that shit go back into your stomach, bro. You ever had to fart, but didn't let it out, and that shit went back into your stomach? Bruh, now all day you messed up, bro. All day until you, bruh, all day, bruh. You never needed to poop at school? Crazy. There's no shot. Bruh, stomach be rumbling, bro. Bruh. <laughs> Listen, rumbling, bro. Today's video is sponsored by Atlas VPN. Atlas VPN is one of the most reliable, easiest to use, and most secure VPN. I'm not gonna hold you. I'm gonna skip that. In 2020, here in the I'm collected. Gonna skip I'm gonna skip that too. I'm gonna skip this too. I'm gonna skip that too. How do you? I'm gonna skip Disney. that. I'm gonna skip this Wi-Fi too. Connect. I'm gonna skip that too. I'm gonna skip this. I'm gonna skip that. You know what I'm saying? Unless Atlas wanna, you know what I'm saying? Hit hit the kid up for a a, a, a sponsorship. You know what I'm saying? I got you. Support my channel by a better food. But, below and get an atlas v you know what i'm saying if y'all want to support me you know what i'm saying i will gladly let the ad play you know what i'm saying atlas vpn you know what i'm saying i can do great ads you know what i'm saying but you know what i mean vpn today thank you is there a better food for a dinner date night than sushi honestly like everything about it just works well for a dinner date night mm -hmm, first mm -hmm. of all the restaurant is always vibes bro 
facts, dim facts, light, facts. cool Asian decor, and the service is usually one step up in quality. Not as nice as like a five-star Brazilian steakhouse, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but way better than like a Chili's. <laughs> you, feel me? you feel a little bougie in like a nice sushi restaurant, bro. And the price definitely reflects it, okay? This is not a cheap date night. You gotta be ready to break off some bread. And that's, hey, listen, chat, I ain't gonna hold you. That tempura ice cream is some heat. That tempura ice cream is some heat. You do you feel me? Oh my god. Deep you hate sushi? Y'all bugging. Sushi is good. You gotta be ready to break off some bread. And you gotta leave a tip, bro. It, it just have some class. Just try to look like you at least, you know, got a little something about you, man. You gotta leave a good tip. But don't get me wrong, okay? This is not a first date kind of restaurant. This is like a, a nice little reward for good behavior on Shorty's part. You know, you don't just take <laughs> any and any girl to get sushi. Facts, facts, facts. Work her way up to that. You know, <laughs> start small, you know, chilies pizza wings and you work your way up to sushi or else you're gonna set the bar too high too early next thing you know you're buying birkins for fat no sir mm -mm, listen if i ever if i ever if i ever had enough money to buy somebody a birkin it would be my mother Simple. I'm not, I'm not, Unless you're my spouse or my mother, then you will get a Birkin. But if you're a girlfriend, don't you ask me for Don't you ever ask me for a Birkin. Don't you ever ask me for a Birkin. You know what I mean? Maybe if we marry... And I got the funds, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not buying my... I don't give a fuck if we've been dating for 10 years. You're not getting a Birkin out of me unless you got a ring from me first. Simple. Simple. <laughs> Mama Simba gonna get a Birkin before anybody. Before anybody. Do you feel me, Chad? Mama Simba getting a Birkin before anybody. Fuck out of here. Fuck is you talking about? Don't you ever... That is not the move, bro. So right before the summer of 2020, last year, this was right before things got <laughs> really- Buddha! What's good with you? This cute little ting ting slid into my DMs, bro. You know what Ooh. I mean? Shorty was from Houston. She caught my attention. So we strike up a little conversation. Next thing you know, she tells me that if I'm ever in the H, I should pay her a visit. Well, fast forward like a month and a half, two of my best friends who formed a duo known as 340 Yori, rappers and now YouTube animators, made the move from Florida to Houston. They used to live with me in Austin, but when I moved to LA, they moved back to their home state of Florida, and now they were gonna get their own place in Houston. So, feeling okay. kinda okay. like a proud big brother because they are a few years younger than me, I wanted to go and see the new spot. So I bought my ticket, made my way to H-Town. So I get to their crib, right? They show me around and I was quite impressed. You know, we spent the day catching up, making TikToks. Now, of course, <laughs> I'm giving Shorty a heads up. That oh, was by me. the way, I'll be in town for a bit next week. Would you be down to meet up? Okay, town, okay. So that, you know, she could make a little town for the boy. As it drew closer to nighttime, I was like, it's go time. So I shoot her a text, letting her know that I was going to be free for the night. And then she said, come through, it's a go. I hit her back like I... Now I'm at her house. Yes, or rather, sir. now I'm at her apartment. Uh, I took an Uber. And I could see that Shorty was living pretty nice. You know what I mean? This was a pretty big high rise. It was looking clean. I was like, okay, all right, let's see what's inside. Then okay. I see this petite little brown thing walk out to the front. She was wearing a black long sleeve top with these short denim jeans. Sheesh. And she had long. Sheesh. Oh, that's one of them ones. Inside. Then I see this petite little brown thing walk out to the front. She was wearing a black long sleeve crop top with these short Sheesh. denim jeans. And she had 
long, flowing black hair. Makeup was all done up, and then I was like, thank God, Jesus, because you, ne you never know. Facts, you ne facts, facts. You never know for real, you know what I'm saying? You think you getting five star, you really get two stars. Never, you never know. No. I mean, we had FaceTimed a couple times before I showed up, but until you meet a girl in person, you don't know what she's going to look like, bro. Facts. So she comes out, introduces herself. Damn, she's short as hell. Golly. Well, I mean, Young Don is like 6'5", right? He like 6'5", right? Then he like 6'5". How tall? Hold on. Let's see. Let's see. How tall? How tall? How tall? How tall? Oh, my God. My stomach is rumbling right now. How tall is Young Don? Young Don the sauce god. Yeah, he's 6'5". Look at me. I'm already, bruh. Listen. No cap. I won't be dating people online because catfish. I mean, there's ways to get around catfish, but there's, I mean, it's hard to get catfish. You might not get catfish with the face if you follow the correct rules, but you can still possibly get catfish body-wise. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, he's 6'5". He's I was, I was, I literally hit the, you know what I'm saying? I, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Gives me a hug. And then leads me up to her apartment. So we get to her spot. She pours What's a couple good, drinks, and we just get to talking. You know, it turns out she was in university. She was about to enter her final year in law school. Grew up in Texas. Dad was Korean. Mom was Mexican. Came from the valley. That's right. She a valley girl. Broke up with her ex a little less than a year ago. Said he was boring. That's a shame. So we turn on some Netflix, and then I let her know that I was feeling a little hungry. So then she's like, uh, I have some pasta. He was boring. Earlier, I could heat it up for you. I was like, eh, I'm not really feeling like pasta right now. So then she's like, do you like sushi? Ooh, sushi. Shorty says she about to blow the bag on dinner. That's what I'm <laughs> talking about. She orders up the food on Postmates. We get okay. a refill on the mimosas. Okay. We on the movie, and then a great night begins. Shawty, I know how this is supposed to go. Uh. Been down this road before. You don't gotta say it to my face. I know that I'm just another face. Yo, on the he smash. Hey, say where he smash on the link up. On the link, she smash on the link up. Oh, young Don got the sauce. Yes, sir. We like those. Give give my man's young Don a yes, sir in the chat. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man smashed on the link up. Yes, sir. Sheesh. Sheesh. Off the link up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Off the link up. That's a that's a W. Sheesh. Fast forward a few hours, and now it's about 2 o'clock in the morning, and we're both fast asleep in bed. It was Sheesh. quiet dark and the only lights were coming from the skyscrapers Jeez. in the distance in downtown houston when suddenly i'm awoken by a strange feeling in my stomach oh no hold on, hold on, hold on. my stomach had the grumbles it wasn't a good sign first i tried oh, to go no. back to sleep hoping i could sleep off whatever this feeling was but the grumbles only got stronger Golly. i realized that i was gonna have to make my way to the bathroom so I carefully slid my <laughs> under Hey, you gotta sneak up. Yo, bro, you gotta make sure she got some spray in there before you blow it up. Unless it's, unless you got a leaky bum, bro. You just gotta go for it, bro. But hopefully she got some spray in there. Yo, down it, bro. Courtesy flush. Chat, courtesy flushes will save your life. Once you poop a little bit, flush that bitch. It don't even matter, bro. Courtesy flush, flush that bit. You know what I'm saying? Once you do, flush it. And she got spray, spray that, bro. Tell you. Underneath Eliminate the smell. I sit up and then I tiptoe my way to the bathroom. Now, I could tell just by the way my stomach was acting that this was about to be bad, bro. And I was worried because oh, it's a big one. Although it was nice, was rather small. In fact, her bathroom door led right into her bedroom. Pretty much. Oh, damn. She was so close to the toilet. That if it were not for this separating wall between us, I would have been able to just reach out and touch her. I was out of time. The nuclear reactor had hit critical mass. There was nothing. 
<laughs> this nigga <laughs> Nigga finna send her whole apartment to the gulag Man, Yeah to be done, so. Big doodle I reach over, turn on the shower ah! I turn on the shower and I just start praying to God That this girl does not smell what I got cooking bro It was agonizing one i couldn't make any noise like verbally you know and this was oh one of those God. dig your heels in and just grunt oh my hey listen y'all hey we all know them we know them doodles them ones that you really it just like them shit don't come out for real it's one of oh my god get through it kind of dumps bro Two, massive i had to flush in between rounds to minimize the smell but facts no, you got them, them courtesy flushes bro it, bruh. And the risk of waking her up and letting her on to the fact that I'm in the middle of desecrating her toilet in the most egregious of ways, my G. And look, yeah. you should be able to take a dump with your girl in the next room. Sucks. But this is not a good look. Yeah, true cooler with the two gifted. You love to see it. Yes, sir. I appreciate the two gifted, my G. You know what I mean? God, Leo, he was blowing her shit up, bro. Look at, look at this, bro. This the thumbnail right here. Cause man's face, yo, he was going through it, chat. He was going through it, chat. That's yo, that is a dookie, bro. When you make this face, this is a dookie, bro. Do you feel me, chat? This is a ho bro. This face is a a doogie, bro. Bro, two. I gave me a sub, so I'm paying it forward. Apparently, someone gave me a sub, so I am paying it forward. Hey, I appreciate that. Thank you for the biddies. That is no longer dookie. That is diarrhea. <laughs> Facts. That's on God, bro. That is on God, bro. God damn. I had to flush in between rounds to minimize the smell. But now I run the risk of waking her up and letting her on to the fact that I'm in the middle of desecrating her toilet in the most Going egregious crazy. of ways, my G. And look, you should be able to take a dump with your girl in the next room. But this is not a good look for the first night, bro. Now she's gonna wonder <laughs> if I'm gonna crawl back into bed with mud butt. Finally, mud butt. <laughs> Yeah, I'm crying. He said he crawled back in the bed with fucking mud butt chat. Chat with fuck <laughs> with fucking mud butt. Bro, I am crying. It was empty. And as soon as I was able, I gathered myself and climbed into the shower to wash away the filth. I get out of the shower, put on some fresh boxers. Pro tip. Always carry a second pair of clean undies when you're going over a girl's house. Then I quietly crawl back under the covers. Moral of the story. If you're butt. about to have a date night with a girl, and it's the first time, and you can choose between eating sushi and homemade pasta. Go with the pasta, bro. Oh my god. Shotty, I know. How this is supposed to go Been down this road before You don't gotta say it to my face I know that I'm just another face Baby, I know that you scared to catch this You don't wanna turn this into baggage He didn't, he didn't clog the toilet? Nah, he flushed in between doodles, you know what I mean? Flushed in between, that's the smart way to play it You gotta flush in between doodles Grizzy, you late You look 5W, what's going on? What you, what you, what you You know what I mean? What you doing? Every day you come in here later and later. I don't, I'm not liking this. But I, I'm, I'm going to talk to you after the video. I'm going to talk to you after the video. You know what I mean? But chat, go ahead and say bye to YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Let's chat it up. You know what I'm saying? Let me let me chat it up with the YouTube babies. Now look here. Don't go to bed with mud butt, chat. Simple as that. Do you know what I'm saying? Do you get me? Are you catching my drift? You know what I mean? So with that being said, we is up out of here, okay? Um, make sure you guys is liking it. Look at this.
Look at this. I got this new thing. I little I added. You feel me? Make sure you guys are liking the video. You know what I'm saying? Let's hit these like goals. Make sure you guys are subbing and turning on post notifications so you don't miss any bangers we fits to drop. Do you feel me? And comment down below what you thought of the video. You know what I'm saying? And comment down below if you don't have mud butt. Simple as that. You know what I mean? But with that being said, me and the Twitch Babies is out. And if you ever want to be a part of the stream and be a part of the video, this is where you need to be. 7.30 Eastern Standard Time, Monday through Friday. Well, like I said... That's it. We gone. We out. Y'all have a good one. Peace. Bye, my butts.